Now we begin with the COVID-19 impact in Iowa. Vaccination rates are rising, but so are cases across our state. Good evening, I'm Stacy Horst. And I'm Steve Carlin. Health experts say vaccinating kids could be key to ending the pandemic. KCCI's Lauren Johnson is live tonight with the next steps toward herd immunity. That's right, Steve. Pharmacists here at Hy-Vee have been very busy getting children vaccinated now that they're eligible. However, doctors say getting to that herd immunity might be a lot more complicated than they originally thought. It makes me feel safe. My best friend just got it yesterday. Logan Vogel joins many other kids around the nation finally receiving a dose of the COVID-19 vaccine. It's incredibly important. Everybody should be getting the vaccine right now. It keeps our family safe. It keeps our close relatives safe. It keeps everybody safe. Be quick and easy. Even though children can be vaccinated against COVID-19, doctors share there are still many obstacles in the way of reaching herd immunity. As positivity rates continue to climb in Iowa, Done. doctors say that goal is a moving target rather than a fixed percentage. Good work, dude. Nice. Herd immunity is really a complex um, a thing to try to you know figure out whether or not we can really achieve that with COVID. Factors about the disease that come into play, factors about how the vaccines work that come into play that determine when we're really going to get to that point. Vaccination rates play a large role in containing the virus, but now we are playing catch up. Continuing to wear a mask while indoors and staying home if you don't feel well are still the best ways to limit spread and reduce positivity rates in Iowa. So it's really a combination of trying to get our vaccine rate high enough to get to herd immunity, but also using mitigation factors to reduce that transmission. That's right. So doctors say it will be a month or two before they see the transmission rates drop between that 5 to 11 age range as far as passing around the COVID-19. And vaccine appointments here at hy can be made on their website. Reporting live here in Des Moines, Lauren Johnson, KCCI 8 News, I was a news leader.